<laughs> Yo, Molly Go Lightly crew is triple OG or better. They they all they all like OG status in the streets. They they just they out here because they was they was in the streets. A bunch of working girls sometimes. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Yeah. Well, I know Molly was. I don't really know if the other ones were. Um, I'm hearing that they all like beef and water and I think then the the young thing, I right, Olivia, let me see. Then she uh lead a scene. Like was she like one of the first ones to leave the group and be like, yeah, Molly is wowing. Molly is on some different type of time. And Molly is on a different type of time. I'm gonna listen to some more of this, but we pretty much are getting the gist of how nasty <laughs> Molly is, man. You hear a little bit more. How's she going to back this up? Right? I stand by that. I'm not taking it fucking back. Ed. I stand by my comment. Wow. I stand by what I said, that she's gone. All right? I stand by that. I'm not taking it fucking back. This is my... Wait, hold on. Am I tripping or is the song in the background screaming, fat boys? Let me... <laughs> Wait, is that saying fat boys in the background while she lying? Right? I stand by that and I'm not taking it fucking back. Ed, I stand by my comment. I stand this by what I said. This is hilarious. All right? I stand by that. That doesn't sound like it was saying fat boys in the back. Yo, Molly over there bumping the fat boy. <laughs> Yo, my bad. Give me a second. I smacked my headphones off. Yo, she... See, now, Molly, that's why your friend tried to snatch that cheese from you. What was it, cheese or was it yogurt? Molly's about to eat a whole block of cheese. Her friend was like, chill. Her friend was like, her friend was like yo, chill out. You, you wild him. You wild him. Don't, don't eat the whole block of cheese. I'm not taking a fucking back. This is my mother. I stand by that. What I seen and what I saw, what I heard, my mom is gone. My mom is. I made my peace with her. That is my grieving. It is not your grieving. But she's not gone, though, from what they're saying. It sounds like you're confirming this, too. And the only reason why I'm even talking about this, you made it public. Why are you coming on here about your, your mom passing? I've, the only thing I've done on live streams or videos, it wasn't for empathy or sympathy, because I spoke about it years after, um, was some relatives have passed. And I've definitely come out and maybe told a story Right. And then let people know that my relative past that I'm telling a story that that is in the story. But I ain't. Hey, I'm sad. Feel bad for me. No. I have literally come on here and streamed and did videos four to five times a day through the worst situations, bro. The worst. Right. Losing a whole bunch of people. I didn't come on here and even talk about it. I came on and just did whatever the subject was for the day or whatever topic my supporters wanted me to speak on, right? Like, so when you come out here and you're, you're doing this empathy and sympathy, I'm losing something and you, it's found to be not true. That's a big deal. That's a big deal. You jumped the shark, Molly. You jumped the shark. It's crazy. You say, you remember fat boys? One of these days, people gonna send him like, "You remember Molly Go Lightly?" Nah. And you can criticize, and you can say, "Oh yeah, you said that." Now, I did not say my mother was dead. I never said that anyway. Thank you, Amber. Thank you so much. I never said that ever. You can say it till the cows come home. You can twist it in your fucking mind any way you want. I never said that. You said she was gone, which insinuates that she's gone. That's that's what you come on. Now she's playing stupid. How hard would it have been for her to say? Sorry, guys, I, I understand that you could have misinterpreted what I said, and that's on me. I should have been more clear. My mom isn't gone. I feel like she's close to. Right? I feel like she's not there already, but she's not officially gone, so I should have clarified. Man, this sounds like I've said something on Twitter. Like, I think something as simple as like, yo, uh, I think I was like, I said I was and off of YouTube or suspended off of YouTube and it was just me trying to quickly let my supporters know that I'm going to be suspended right for a little while and then when I seen one comment saying oh snap they, they got you for permanently I had to jump on and go yo 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 it's just for two weeks my bad I wasn't even thinking when I made the post 
I was just trying to keep you guys informed. I should have clarified even more so you guys wouldn't be confused to think that it was worse. Right. Um, that's how an adult would handle a situation. Molly just going double down. Double down, Molly. My sister knows I never said that. Everybody knows I did not say that. You can follow the leader or whatever, anywhere you want. This is my mother. Thank you very much. Yeah, she could have. Uh, I'm seeing you in the chat, guys in the chat saying, does she mean dementia? And she could have just misworded it. Absolutely. That could absolutely be a possibility. It could be anything and she just misworded it, right? If I'm not mistaken, then she brought up like cancer or something. I don't want to speculate and say what it is, but yeah, if anyone knows, clarify it in the chat or in the comment section if you can. But she's like, she on some ish. Uh, let's be, let's be clear. Like she, she's dead wrong for this, right? And why she's dead wrong is because it could have been just miswording, but now she's doubling down on it instead of saying, "Hey guys, I maybe I misspoke." my bad for that i could have clarified a little bit more especially if i'm going to talk about something this sensitive but think about this the same way she's talking about her mother she talks about these children that are missing or any of these crimes that she covers think about all the things she gets wrong think about that all the time she messes up and refuses to say i messed up i was wrong I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have said that. And I'm not saying just because people are asking for it. No, no, no. I'm not with the cancer culture. I'm not with you apologizing just because you feel like you have to. No, I mean, like as in being an uh, actual virtuous human being and taking accountability. When you do say something that's wrong or that can be perceived a certain way, there's times when I say things and this is just in personal life. It could be perceived as if I'm not paying attention or I'm not actually taking what the person said into consideration. I've had that happen and I had to explain it and like let it be known and apologize. Like, yo, I'm sorry that that's what you received from that. That's not what I meant. And that's my mistake. I have to do better at letting people know that I do hear them. Right. And I don't want people to feel, especially if I care about you, like I'm not considering what you what you have to say. Right. So like, I think that that's just part of being an adult. Even if you don't mean it a certain way, if it's perceived a certain way from someone that that you value. And I would say that she values her supporters and fans. Right. These are people that get her through. She would express, hey, guys, like this is not what I meant, but I understand how it could be perceived this way. 